I'm going to show you how to set up any event on a Google server completely free of charge is without paying a buck. So let's do it in less than 10 minutes. Just remember to follow us on our social media or send us an email if you want us to work with you in your project or company. We make automations integrating the artificial intelligence to make any process more efficient. We start here in the Google Cloud Console page. That is console.cloud.google.com. And we move here to the navigation bar and we type compute engine we go to the left side where we see vm instance that's a virtual machine so we need to create a virtual machine to host the server with google i already have a virtual machine so what you need to do is just create a new instance you're going to see several options to set up then we need to follow some instructions to achieve the setup google has a program that it's called um google cloud free program so these are the three most important sections that we need to pay attention to the first one is the kind of desk the second one is the region where our server is going to be located. And the third one is the limit and the instance that we're going to use. Based on that, we select the option that is called US Central Iowa. Just make sure that the E2 option is selected. We change this for the E2 micro option. We move to the OS and storage. We can increase the limit because we have up to 30 gigabytes. And we change here for standard persistent disk. We click on select and we move to the networking because we're going to check the three boxes that we have here and we just click on create. Once the virtual machine is created, we click here on SSH is the secure shell, like the common prompt in Windows. We just need to authorize the access and log in with the account that we are using now. And pretty much that's it. This is the last thing we've got. We just need to install Docker because we're going to use a Docker container. We install the Docker container. We install the Anything app in the Docker container. Then we run the Docker container with a domain. The domain, remember that we need one for this configuration and allow the access through the virtual machine and through the Google Cloud services. You will find this super detailed step-by-step -step guide in our webpage. You just need to go to novoagent.com. And just in case that you require a more detailed and visual step-by-step -step of this, we made a video. This is in our YouTube channel. Just click there and see the whole process.